Oh, what is up, guys? It is me, Game Kid Dude, back with another video. And in today's video, I'm gonna be showing you guys a quick look at my Game Kit Locker Tour. Now, I'm gonna give you or show you guys my games and also how I got them and stuff, or when I got them. So yeah, and how much I remember they cost. I I can't or the rarities. So yeah, and warning: this is gonna be the last video until August next month because Game Kit. You know, the shop is down, so I can't make too much Game Kit co content right now, unless if Game Kit has a big update, like a new game mode or something, then I would do a, um, content for that. But for now, um, if they don't, if they don't make any up up updates, oh my gosh, sorry about my stuttering, then I'll make a video on the new, um, update or the shop when it returns. So, my first game ever is the Snow Muff, and this is an uncommon, and... It says, who said snowballs can get a little chilly? And yeah, I'll, I'll read the descriptions. So, um, this one was actually a free game. It was didn't cost anything. It came around Christmas or December, of course. It's Christmas themed a little bit. And I really like this game. It, it has, like, I like the fluffiness on it. It's, like, nice and simple. I like how it has its little earmuffs there. It's, like, really cute and nice, I guess. So, yeah, I really like the snow muff game. I'm pretty glad I got it, and it was free, so it was a pretty good deal. Uh, next we have is the festive onesie, and he's the blue one, and he's a rare. It says, can't see, I mean, can't wait to see what you got me. This is part of the Comfy and Cozy collection, and this one, of course, is not free, but, yeah, this is a rare. I don't remember how much it cost, I think, like, 500 game bucks, or, no, 300, I, I can't really remember. It was, it was also in Christmas, too. I really like how it's like bundled inside the a sweater, and there's also other colors of this type of the festive ones. These are like red, yellow, and green, and the blue one. I like the blue one because I really like that color. So yeah. Oh wait, my gosh! I just noticed this that on the colors of the rarities, they're the like background of all the games are like the color of the rarities. That's actually cool. Like green for uncommon, blue for rare, purple for epic, and gold for legendaries. That's pretty cool. I didn't notice that. Um, next, um, I guess we'll do Doug. So Doug is part of the, um, well, Goldrush collection, but he's actually from one of, from the seasonal ticket, which I got, which was five bucks, which is pretty good. Now with game bucks, with actual money. And I don't know if when the, sh the, s the seasonal ticket closes that that um they're gonna have brand new ones and this is, they're not gonna I'm not gonna own these so that's why I'm making this locker tour kind of early because I'm not too sure about it if it's gonna be disappeared when the new um seasonal ticket comes I don't know if I'm still gonna have them or if you could still keep them but I don't know so yeah Doug is a rare um and it says keep digging just a little bit further and I really I like the name of him Doug it sounds pretty cool he also he has his um, construction hat which looks cool and I like how he's kind of dirty like he has dust on him like he's probably like a worker or something or he like mines or something I don't know I don't really know what he's like what job he's supposed to have or probably he probably is a miner or okay not the other one the, like like digging okay guys oh my gosh um that sounds wrong oh my gosh. But yeah, like, digging and stuff. Because it says he's part of the Gold Rush collection, so yeah. So, uh, I'll do... I'll do Block Party. So, this is Block Party. I feel like they should have named him something else, like Muddy. Or Blocky or something, I'm not too sure. So this, um... He's an epic, of course. He's And he actually changes different colors, which is pretty cool. Like, different, like, rock material and brown. He shouldn't changes different types of whole like dirt or something which is pretty cool and it says yeah animated cycles through different terrains which is pretty cool and he's part of the goldish collection as well and there's also a sticker that goes along with him the uh let me see what it's called i kind of forgot or not a, a trail my but not a sticker it's the dug up stick um uh, rail Sorry, trail my gosh what's wrong with me so yeah that one really fits well with that and also the the hammer one fits well with Doug. Um, I guess I didn't notice that. But yeah, um, I'll do okay. I'll do Cumulus. I think that's how you pronounce it. So yeah, this is Cumulus. He's an epic. I don't know if that's how you pronounce his name, Cumulus, or Cumulus. I'm just gonna call it that. 
Um, he's part of the for the forecast calls for rain. Oh, my bad. I thought I was reading the wrong thing. That's what it says. It says for the description the for the forecast calls for the rain, and he's part of the storm collection. My bad. Yeah, I really like the design. It's like, it's like a like a stormy cloud or something. I don't know what a camel this is. Probably some sort of cloud or something. He's pretty cool to have. Um. I'll do, yeah, I'll just do Sprout. So next we have Sprout. I really like this one. He's, he or she's pretty, I don't know if um, games have genders or anything. But Sprout looks pretty, he, he looks pretty pretty, um, like the flowers on it. I really, I like nature, so this is pretty cool. So he's a rare, and it says Flower Power, and he's part of the Blossom Collection, which is really cool. So I like the design, like he's really detailed, that the flowers are different colors, which is pretty cool. As a pot, as pretty detailed as well, the designs, it's, it's really nice, I really like this game, so it's pretty cool, um, next we have is Lifesaver, I don't know why I love Lifesaver so much, I, I don't know, I, just, I like the floaty, I think he has the oxygen thing, and the goggles, it just looks really cool, and unfortunately he's not like an epic or anything, but he's a rare, well, at least it's not uncommon, it says keep it afloat, and he's part of the beach collection, and this one fits well with the beach balls as well. And also, uh, my bad, I, this um, little sprout actually fits with sprout himself. So yeah, the, most of these stickers and trails match with the actual season ticket gims. And I think some, some of the trails and stickers that are in some of the shops match well with some of the gims that are in the shop sometimes. I don't know. So next we have Audible Melanie. Or Melody. I feel like they shouldn't name this one Melanie because I don't know. So this is Melody. Um, I really like the design. I really love Watermelon. And he's an epic, which is pretty good. Slice into Summer. And he's part of the barbecue collection. Speaking of that, 4th of July is almost is around the cor corner. So that's yeah, pretty cool. And uh, rem barbecues remind me of the 4th of July. And yeah, I really like the seeds. That they put the seeds around his uh, eyes. That's really cool. And he's like... The texture of him, like the his, like the inside of the watermelon, is pretty cool. I I know his games are really detailed, which is pretty cool, and they remind me of a show I like, BFD. I don't know if you guys probably know that, but I don't know. Um, and this is my rarest game. He's a legendary. His name is Mine Ride. He's also part of the Gold Rush Collection, and it says keeping production on track. That's a interesting. That's pretty cool description so as you can see i really this one has a lot of detail like as you can see he has tires on him. he has like a little lever on his on him he has like a pickaxe inside some gold and a ladder inside i think a ladder wouldn't be that small but that's well that's the best i could do i can't complain i really like the design and the detail on this but to be honest i'm not a big fan of the games that are not oval shaped like circles like when they're just like boxy or something i'm not a big fan of those shapes of games to be honest but but since this is a legendary, I like it, so, yeah, that's pretty rare. And for the last one, probably my favorite, or I don't know, maybe one of my favorites, I'd like, I don't know, maybe one of my favorites. So this is Sizzle Star, and to be honest, guys, this, I actually I accidentally bought this one on accident. Uh, this is, yeah, it was interesting, I actually got this one. I'm kind of glad I accidentally got it, because this is a really good design, and it's really good for a rare, so, yeah. He's like really detailed. He has a bunch of colors, which is really good. And this came out around like the first, like I think, at the beginning of the year, 2024. So yeah, this is shining bright and ready to light up the night. And he's part of the fireworks collection. So yeah, I really love Sizzle Star. He's a really good game. So yeah, he's really cool. I like the design of him. So yeah, guys, those are all my games. And also, wait a second, Doug is a little off center there. <laughs> I don't know if that's a weird glitch or something. But yeah, guys, um, these are all my stickers if you guys want to look at them. I'm not going to look over my stickers or my trails. I kind of did a little bit by matching the games, of course. But the games are mainly the main focus of this video. Anyways, guys, um, hope you guys liked the video. If you did, please like and subscribe for more videos. And yeah, guys, I'll see you next time. This is me, Gim Kid Dude, signing off. Bye, guys.